Active learning ambush. Active learning ambush. Hello and welcome to Active Learning Ambush. I'm so excited for this episode. The instructor we're going to see today is Legend. His name has come up so many different times. What we're about to see today has come up so many different times. So I'm really excited to finally get this on camera. Now, usually with Active Learning Ambush, we try to share ideas that you can just replicate in the classroom. This one's a little bit different. You're probably not gonna be able to replicate this in your classroom, but hopefully it will give you some inspiration and creativity for what you can do. All right, let's go. And when you understand that there are programs so we're going to thank you. Hi, Bruce. How are you? Oh, hi. <laughs> I'm ambushing you today. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing good. I'm so excited uh, for, for today. Is this like everything that you got going on? Yeah, this is it. Yeah, we'll go outside. And, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the experiment stuff is over here. Demo stuff is over here. Uh, I'm gonna need some help with the demonstration though. All right, so I guess uh, first thing is, Gustavo, can you swing a sledgehammer at something and not miss it? This is like a commercial, you know. Oh, it's so yeah, I put the, the you know the, the, the you know bride together good enough. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> I need to. You can do it. Okay, good. All right. So yes, he. Uh, you need to swing a sledgehammer and not miss. Okay, so um, I also need somebody, uh, maybe, uh, you know, can you help me out there? I mean, you look the cement block. Okay, good. So I need, uh, I need you to put some cement blocks on something. Okay. So we'll do this right here. Um, so where's Jesse? Oh, there you are. Okay, so there's your weapon of mass destruction. All right. Um, so. So think about the little thing you did the other day. You had the nail between, right, finger and thumb, and you squeezed a little bit, right? And because the point of the nail maybe hurt a little bit, didn't hurt a lot, right? But it, you certainly, certainly the point of the nail, having very small area, created a fairly large pressure against your finger, right? Versus the, you know, the head of the nail, not so much. So the point of the nail caused hurt. And I said pressure equals pain, right? Pressure equals pain. Force doesn't necessarily equal pain, it's, it's pressure. It's force over area that creates pressure and that can create pain, all right? So, so that was one nail. And you squeezed a little bit, you didn't squeeze real hard, because sque if you squeezed real hard, you might have actually punctured your finger with a nail, right? But the pressure was tolerable, the pain was tolerable, tolerable because the, the force was not huge, even though the point of the nail is tiny it creates a fairly large pressure, right? So, so kind of keep that in mind, right? That you did not puncture yourself because the force on that nail was not huge, right? Okay, so we're gonna do a, kind of a related but scaled up demonstration, all right? So, um, so let's just do these down here, all right? Um, like I said, I've got a kind of a scaled up demo here. Um, so put that block over there. So you're gonna run the blocks, right? Okay. Yeah, good, okay. So. Um, we're going to put the blocks on something, and then yes, he's going to hit the top block, okay? In fact, when you pile them on, can you pile it so that it's uh, like flat side up, like that? Okay, and you're going to hit the top one, all right? All right, so, so we have to have something to put them on, okay? Um, actually, can a couple people, you guys uh, kind of just spread the sheet out flat on the on the pavement there, on the sidewalk? Just, just lay out flat. That's to catch the debris, all right? So what do you think is going to happen with the cement block when she hits it with a sledgehammer? It's going to shatter. Sure, yeah, that's that's to catch the debris. Okay. <laughs> that, that was beautiful. <laughs> right. You're not throwing it, are you? You're just going to just going to swing it, all right? You're going to try to toss it. I've hit sledgehammers with tires. <laughs> you think I'm like so built? <laughs> all right, so so we got to have something to put the uh, the cement blocks on, and that's going to be this piece of wood. All right, but this is kind of a, a, a peculiar piece of wood. Yeah, thanks. Um, it's a piece of wood with about 700 nails in it. All right, so would you verify those are real nails? They're real nails. Yeah, they're, good. they're, they're, good. they're not rubber nails, they're real nails. All right, so this is, this is about 700 of them in this piece of wood. It's about a foot by about a foot and a half. All right, it's about 700 nails in there. Okay, so, so the idea is this is going to be down. 
and the cement blocks are going to sit on top of this, all right, with one of them flat side up, all right? So both of them are going to be put on this, okay? All right, so now we need, we just need something to put this on, all right? That's going to be me. Oh. All right, so. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not completely crazy, so I'm going to wear a face mask, and I'm going to wear some gloves, all right? So you're going to pile the cement blocks on top of here. This is going to be on me. And you're going to smash the top block. So the nails, nails go down. No, I can't do this. No, no. <laughs> no, you can do it. You can do it. This is why there's a camera here. <laughs> yeah. yeah this is, that's right. This is, I know, for proof and uh, this is just legal action. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that doesn't, first one doesn't matter. No, okay, good. That's one. Oh, you lie. Oh, no. Oh, no. Well, that <laughs> Flat down. Yeah. So, you know, fair amount of weight. Each block's probably 30, 40 pounds. But now, you know, it's supported. Okay. You ready? Anytime you're ready. Then, now don't swing to kill, just just swing to break. Okay. I know, so. I was like, Jesus. So we got a couple things going on here. Let me get these off here. Um, 700 nails. Oh, I'm, a, I'm a little cut up as well. You, you touch one nail, you get cut. 700 of them, though, right? The force is. So the force per nail is fairly small. Yeah. So the pressure per nail is tolerable. It doesn't, it doesn't perforate the, the stuff, all right? Uh, so I'm, I don't have any holes in me, mm -hmm. all right? I'll go take a drink later and see if I leak, all right? But anyway, so, so the idea is similar to what you did, right? The force per nail is not so high because there's 700 nails, right? And so the pressure is tolerable. Now, what if I only had like 10 of them in here? What would happen? It would kill you. Oh, sure, yeah, it would stick right in me, right? You know, I'd be prying the board off, right? So you so got to have a lot of nails so yeah. that the, the pressure per nail is, is relatively low and, and not fatal, all right? So, so there's that. Um, the, uh, the blocks themselves weigh a fair amount, but again, the force is relatively low the, per nail because, you know, if you think about if we had 70 pounds worth of blocks divided by 700, right? That's only a tenth of a pound per nail. That's nothing, right? Well, listen, it's a great way to learn physics, though. You know? <laughs> so as opposed to like reading about it in the book, you can see your teacher get a cinder block. <laughs> <That's right>. Yeah. <laughs> you measure the impulse, basically, the force over the time. Actually, uh, we'll do one more slowly turn. Thank you, guys. We'll do one more thing. I don't need that. All right, so I need two spotters. You, you two spot, one on each side of me. All right. No, we don't need that. Oh, no, you're fine. You're fine. Right, so, yeah. Seth, come on over here. All right, so, um, so you guys, you guys spot. All right. So come on over here. So Hannah, or, or yeah, you, you over here. Yeah, you here. All right. So Seth, you guys grab a hold of him. So Seth, one foot here. Step up. Yeah, yeah. Just, just, just hold on to him. Just spot him. Come on, step right up. All the way. Step. Go ahead. Up you go. All. Yep. Okay, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> so now that you know, pretty good size force, but spread out over 700 nails. So the force per nail is still pretty small. What do you weigh? About 250. 230. 230. Okay. Yeah. Congratulations. <laughs> so 230 divided by 700 is still only about, well, that'd be about three tenths of a pound per nail. So again, the pressure is tolerable. Right? I don't want to lay there all day like that, all right? But <laughs> okay, but same idea, right? So anyway, all right, good. Thank you for walking all over. Me. All right, so. Thank you so much for joining us for the summer edition of Active Learning Ambush. Like I said before, we don't expect you to do the cement block smash after watching the video, but hopefully you are inspired. 
Thank you for watching.